special, Dream Night with the Blues. Proceeds of this event go to benefit the Dream Factory of St. Louis, granting wishes to seriously ill children and their families. Tonight, fans get one-on-one -on -one with players. They can play foosball, air hockey, bubble hockey, get pictures and take autographs. In fact, I saw Paul Cree over there, down by one in a little game of air hockey. Hopefully he can come back, he's got 30 seconds left. Let's go see what some of the fans have been doing. Both players and fans are having an amazing time at Dream Night. And the most important thing is that 92 cents of every dollar goes directly to granting the wishes of seriously ill children. In fact, over the last 13 years, the St. Louis Blues have helped raise more than $300,000 for the Dream Factory of St. Louis. Both players and fans agree tonight goes to help an amazing cause. It's a wonderful opportunity for fans to meet and greet the players. Uh, it's a great opportunity for the players to get in touch with the fans. Um, and just really it all goes to such a wonderful cause that it, it's a great thing to be involved in. For us to spend a couple hours of our time to come here and raise some money for uh, kids to have their dreams realized. They're, they're dealing with horrible diseases that they didn't ask for, they've done nothing wrong, and we can put a smile on their face that way. It's, it's really nothing for us to come out here tonight. up Dream Night here with the auctioning off of the jerseys, the highlight of the night. And if you missed out, you missed on a great time. Fans got to interact one-on-one -on -one with their favorite player, maybe play a game, get an autograph, take a picture. And most importantly, we raised a lot of money for the Dream Factory of St. Louis. If you missed out, make sure you make plans early next year to be here for Dream Night with the Blues.